So, time for the starters all his qualifiers next. As ever, it's the hurdle first. And these conditions to these races change from week to week. This week it's a two mile three furlong 0 to 110. And at the top we've got Ozark Frid for Vinnie Gerrard. Odyssey for Paul Rhodes. Gold Staple for Alex Cherry. Nothing fancy for Martin Lee on the Joker for Obi Wan. And Alexander Minx for Stu Gray. So six this time then. And Obi Wan and myself would like to welcome the rest of you back after the last race, which we presumably watched on our own. And away we go. And. Nothing fancy is the first one to show them as they make their way towards the first of the flights in this 12 of which they're going to have to negotiate. And Gold Staple is in second. They get to the first and they're all safe over it with a quick jump by Gold Staple has seen that one go into the lead. So Gold Staple then from Odyssey second, the Joker third, then Alexander Minx, Ozark Frid and the one that started quickly. Nothing fancy is now the back marker. But yeah. Very tightly grouped, in fact, Gold Staple leads by three lengths as they get over the second. The rest of them were virtually in a line until they jump that hurdle, and then the quicker jumpers have gone ahead of the rest. But Gold Staple is the leader, nothing fancy, is now second. And then momentarily, been at the back, the Joker is in third, then closest to us, the two shades of green of Ozark Frid. And on that one's inside Odyssey. And with Paul Rhodes' new set of colours, and then at the back, Stu Gray on Alexander Minx. So making their way towards the next flight then. And Gold Staple is enjoying a five length lead undisputed at this point. With nothing fancy second, the Joker third. As they get to the third, and we'll safely over that one. Hurdling well. And Gold Staple is clear. Nothing fancy just showing in second. As they get over the fourth, the top white Ozark Frid. Jump that one nicely into second place. Short one to the fifth, which they all take well as well. And Gold Staple will lead them past the stands. That's the big screen. And past the winning post. With the complete circuit of the track to go. Six lengths clear, Gold Staple. Ozark Fruit is in second. And the Joker in the yellow jacket third, closest to us. Odyssey is just fourth. Nothing fancy on the inside is fifth. And the back marker is Alexander Minx. As they swing right handed then, racing away from the stands and get over flight number six. Which they all got over okay, nothing fancy, was a little bit untidy. But they're in almost Indian file now, with Gold Staple four clear. Looks to have got a pretty firm hold on Ozark Frid in second though. The Odyssey is third, and the Joker, and nothing fancy, just being niggled along. And Alexander Minx is still at the back, keeping the field in sight. Into the final mile, and over the seventh flight. Yes, they all got over OK, and Gold Staple still going well in front, but been out on his own for a long time. Ozark Frid is in second. Odyssey third, the Joker's now over to the outside, and nothing fancy. He's going to try and get up the inside rail. Alexander Minx is just four lengths off the rest of them, and being given the hurry up by the jockey as they get over the eighth which they all get over nicely and suddenly Gold Staples leads down to a couple as Odyssey moves into second Ozark Frid on the inside nothing fancy is now pulled out to make a challenger on the outside of them then the, the Joker not made a move on that one yet and Alexander Minx is suddenly toiling in their wake six lengths adrift as they get over the ninth a mistake there by the Joker when he was starting to make a move and that one's seeing that one drop out of it a little bit now then so it's Gold Staple kicking on again Gold Staple then from Odyssey who's gone in hot pursuit two lengths down a gap of four then to Ozark Frid and nothing fancy the Joker's trying to recall from that mistake but it's Gold Staple Staple, who's in the lead. They've got three flights of hurdles still to take and just over three furlongs still to race. Gold Staple, four clear of Odyssey in second. Ozark Frid in third, nothing fancy in fourth. Surely between these now can't see the other two getting into it as they come down towards the third last flight. Then now they're into the straight and it's Gold Staple who's four or five clear over the third last. Gets over it nicely, gets away from it well. Odyssey is chasing in second. Ozark Frid under a big weight third. Then nothing fancy now dropping out of it in fourth. It's Gold Staple at the second last. Gets over it nicely but Odyssey jumps it really well and now looms on the outside and in a matter of strides Odyssey is taking it up it's Odyssey over the final flight Odyssey gets over it and Odyssey pulls away now as they race up towards the line Odyssey has gone three or four lengths clear up towards the line this is going to be another one for the professor as Odyssey takes it Odyssey wins it from Gold Staple second Ozark Frid third the Joker ran away to be fourth uh, nothing fancy dropped out of it Alexander Minx was running on gamely at the end but it's Odyssey for Paul Rhodes 
Uh, Preakness stakes one day. Starters all just heard on qualify the next. Odyssey the winner. Let's take a look at the full list then. Odyssey for Paul Rhodes wins it. Gold Staple for Alex Cherry was second. Ozark Fred for Vinnie Gerard third. The Joker for Obi-Wan was fourth. And Nothing Fancy for Martin Lidham was fifth.